All right, guys, so we have kin folks out here that are hunting, and they've been seeing fox every time they hunt. So yesterday we set out about seven, seven traps targeting a fox, coyote, and bobcat. And even with the rain last night, it just smells so good. Like, he still got in the trap. So we caught us a gray fox today. The way I did this trap, I just did a simple flat set. Just to get a log about that big around. Flat, round, flat is the best. Put your bait under it. Put pee on top of it. Put your trap right in front of it and you got a fox. Okay, guys, whenever you catch a fox, I like to get a catch pole, or I'm sorry, if you catch anything, I like to get a catch pole, bring it away from the track, because you if you shoot it right there, and it, like, bleeds, then it's not very good for the next animal to come, because they'll smell that, and they will be scared, so always bring your animal away from the trap whenever you're going to dispatch it. Okay, guys, so we did end up getting him, and he is off the trap. We just got to make sure he don't get away now. Okay, guys, so we're going to go ahead and put them down, and we're going to reset the trap and go catch some more the next day. Okay, so we <clears throat> put the fox down, and now I put my trap back in the ground. It's ready, and all I got to do now is bait it. So, you got your gray fox pee. Squirt a little bit on your log. I got this is homemade bait. Like, all mine is homemade. I don't buy hardly any of mine. Like, it's good bait. You know, screw it. I need a decent stick somewhere. Get some out. Try to put it under that log. Leave the rest. Simple as that. Alright, I'll call y'all back. Or y'all can come watch me again whenever I go catch something else.